Welcome back Year 7 and thank you for completing the D major scale on the form. Now we're going to look at our B flat major scale. The reason why we're looking at this is because very much like D major we have two accidentals in the key signature. However, hopefully you'll notice that they are not sharps in the key signature this time, they are flats. Okay, So we have a slightly different um, setup for our accidentals here. We're B flat major, so our tonic note is B flat. We then follow the musical alphabet up, C, D, E, F, G, A, B. Exactly the same principle. Now we need to look at the key signature and see which flats we need to use. Now, we've got a flat on the third line here, so we follow the, the uh, saying, every good boy deserves football. So it's every good boy, that is a B flat. So you can see B flat has uh, been entered there and B flat has been entered there. Now we've got a second flat here. Now it's on the fourth space. So for the notes on the spaces, we have face in the space. We just spell face, F, A, C, E. So we have an E flat. And as you can see, the E has a flat sign next to it because of our key signature. Okay, exactly the same principle as D major, except this time it's flats and not sharps. Okay. Now what we're going to do is move on to our triad creation. The reason why scales are really useful is because they help us work out what notes are going to be in certain chords so that we always have a very pleasant sound when we're constructing a song in that particular key. Okay? We have seven keys to construct, seven chords to construct, sorry. Um, chord one is going to start on a D, now we follow the principle. Because we've got the key already, we don't need to do very much hard work. We've done the D, we skip the E and we get an F sharp. We skip the G and we get an A. So our chord one is a D, F sharp and A. That's our first triad. Our second chord or second triad um, is going to be starting on note two, which you can see is an E here. We follow exactly the same principle. We play, we skip. We play, we skip, we play. So our second chord is going to be E, G, and B. Okay. What I would now like you to do is to construct the third, fourth, fifth, sixth, and seventh chords or triads in D major. Remember, we're always going to start on the relevant note that is attached to it from the scale. Okay. That is going to be completed on the Microsoft forms that you have in front of you. After that, ladies and gents, we're going to do exactly the same but for B flat major. We went through the scale already, starts on a B flat, we then follow the musical alphabet, C, D, E flat, because we had the flat in the key signature, F, G, and finally an A. Now if we get on to moving to the triads, we've got chord one here, begins in a B flat, Follow exactly the same principle. We skip, we play, that becomes a D. We skip, we play, that becomes an F. So triad one or chord one is B flat, D and F. Chord two is going to start on the C because that is our second note. C, skip, play, E flat, skip, play, G. So then I want you to construct triad three, four, five, six and seven in B flat major. Remember, ladies and gents, it should always be done on the Microsoft forms that you see in front of you. So here, I want chord three of D major. You need to put the three notes in there. Three notes for chord four, for chord five, for chord six, and for chord seven. The same will happen for B flat major, chord three, chord four, chord five, chord six, and chord seven. Once you have put all those notes in year seven, you need to make sure that you click submit. Okay, that will send it directly to me and I will be able to see the scores that you've got for your particular lesson. Thanks very much for listening. If you do have any problems with any of the content that is on here, you can always email me. But I think it's pretty self-explanatory. We just need to move through this form that we see. Okay, good luck. Thank you very much and I look forward to seeing your outstanding scores. 
All the best. Bye-bye.